Hi, I'm Dr. Altman. I'm here in San Francisco standing outside the Golden Gate Bridge. This is an incredible structure. Beautiful, beautiful design. They keep it well painted. It's a lot of fun. Now, in my youth, I used to be a diver. Dive off of tall things. I've dove off bridges before. I wonder what would happen if I dove off this bridge. The potential energy standing on that deck would be equal to the height times my mass times the acceleration due to gravity. The distance from the deck to the water is 67 meters. My mass is about 90 kilos and acceleration due to gravity is 9.8 meters per second squared. So my potential energy standing on that deck would be 59,094 joules. That's a lot of potential energy. If I were to then jump into the water, I would lose all of my potential energy and it would turn into kinetic energy. So when I hit the surface of the water, I'd have a kinetic energy of 59,094 joules. Kinetic energy is what, one half mv squared? So that gives me a velocity as the square root of two kinetic energy divided by m. It gives me a velocity about 36 meters per second. 36 meters per second. That doesn't sound like too much. Let's see, what is it in something I'm used to, miles per hour? Let's see, 36 meters per second times one mile over uh, 1609 meters times uh, 3,600 seconds per hour. That's, uh, oh, that's about 81 miles an hour. <laughs> I would hit the water at about 81 miles an hour. I would probably bounce off the water. I think I'll not do that. But this is an amazing bridge, isn't it? A lot of fun physics. Hope you enjoyed your visit. I know I am. Ah, uh, looks like Alcatraz right there. Right by the Golden Gate Bridge. So you'd be in prison, but you'd have a lovely view.